Hello and welcome to another episode of Graveyard Keeper. We have just had a quick nap to save the file. And I believe I heard yes. <laughs> Dear comrade, it is my assignment to inform you. ECO PODP, in a plenary meeting, made the decision. What? Sorry, e eco who? <laughs> ECO PODP, the executive committee of the party of the donkey's proletariat. Uh, naturally. <laughs> you are addressing as general secretary, by the way. <laughs> ah, that, ex that explains everything. So, the ECO PODP has decided to give you one last chance to rehabilitate yourself in the eyes of enlightened labor. Okay. Well, thanks. Uh. Our party has reached phase of active preparation for revolutionary upheaval, and your role will be key. And if I refuse? <laughs> then we'll burn down your home, graveyard, garden, and church. <laughs> and worst of all, you'll be publicly reprimanded and placed on the party's blacklist. <laughs> We're glad you've agreed to help. Now come closer and listen carefully. As you realize, this is all top secret. We'll communicate via notes. Notes and... <clears throat> How are you going to write notes? Those who know less sleep better, and I wouldn't recommend smelling them. Ugh. First, prepare and send to our post office a cookbook for our friend, the Rat Chef. Chief. He loves cuisine. And the success of the revolution will be impossible without the rat's help. Second, send to our post office five red apples. To raise the morale of the oppressed donkey commune, you must... Wait, I have no way to send you all of this stuff discreetly. You said this is top secret, therefore... <laughs> therefore, it's your responsibility to create and install a special box for contraband. <laughs> you will be stuffing all the contraband inside the box. I don't know why I said contraband. And then I or other party members will take them away under the cover of night. But don't worry, you'll manage it. I believe in you. Good luck, tails crossed. Um, 50 ways to cook ratatouille with vegetables and cats. Okay, so we got that, but clearly, uh, oh, here we go. Alright, this is the thing. So we got the, the cookbook and the apples. Now what do we need for this? We need two stone. So let's go get some stone so we can repair that. And we'll collect some of those iron ingots. Can we get this stone here? Don't think we can. How frustrating. Okay, so... With that in mind, let's get this stone. A piece of stone, so we need two of those. Right, we got that, so we can go down and repair that. And then from there... I don't know, there's, there's so much to actually investigate, so... There we go, we've repaired the hatch. That means bodies will be dumped down there. That can be repaired with Fitch and simple iron parts. And then we can craft more things. I don't know... Does this require repairing on the inside as well? It does, okay. So, two more stone, four more iron parts. And then, of course, there is this, which requires a wooden beam. So, beyond our ken at the moment. Now, if we look at technologies, we can learn important parts, but that'll really tank our stuff there. Ooh. 
what I'm looking for is the way to get science. Uh, garden bed and sticks and trunk. So let's unlock that. And transplanting. And beekeeping. Just because they're there, they need to be done and they will help us. We'll look at smithing. Uh, we could do sword, like weapon and armor, but that's not super necessary right now. Clay is. And so is mining. Um, okay, so we got all of that. And then we got cookery, which has everything locked off. So we should be okay at that point. So we'll go up here, collect some of those, and I guess begin looking at what the NPCs want. We've got... The bishop wants bowls, so I think we had clay somewhere. And we can make a potter's wheel. Let's put the potter's wheel there. And then we'll have to work out whether we can expand the yard or something. Ceramic bowls. So we now have, uh, let's have a look at, we now have 12, we needed 20. So that's three more. We do not have enough, so let us have the yeah, energy energy potion. I was about to call it the mana potion, this is simply because it was blue. And you know, if it, if it's blue, it means mana, right? Radio. So we got that. I'm still not 100% sure where I'm supposed to start studying. And I realize I should have checked that before jumping into this episode, but hey. Like, where I need to get those science points. Because that's really all I need. I just need some science points. And I imagine it's a... Um, yeah, it doesn't actually say where you get science. Let's have a quick look. Alright. So what we need is the ruined book and river sand. Now, we unlock the technology to dig up the river sand, I believe. I think. We'll find out, I guess. But with that... We should be able to craft a book, craft paper, study the paper, get the science. It, it's, it's a little bit obtuse in the game, and I don't know whether that's because I've missed it or what. Either way. Yep, either way, we've got it now, we can move forward. And it... It becomes something we never really get stuck on again. <laughs> but with that done, let's quickly check this. What do we need for repairing? Plank, bitch, and nails. Wow. We can actually get that done. I don't know if it's something we're in a rush to do, but it's certainly something I would like to do. Oh, we got a body here. Let us go and identify what we need to do with the body. So we pick up the body here. Chuck it on the table. And we've got three red. So let's take the fat out. And the blood. 
Oh, we don't have enough to finish taking the blood, so we're just going to have some bread. And we got that and that out. Now, I don't think meat, skin, skull, or bones will be good, so we're going to take that body just for now. And we're going to try bearing. The reason I'm not taking everything just now is because, quite simply, we have no need for it at this point. Once we do, once it becomes something that we can actually uh, utilize, then we'll probably look at making a few bodies. But that is buried and it's minus one. But we do have the certificate of burial, which means we can sell that for some money too. Right, so let's go down here and craft some... Huh? I thought, oh, maybe we don't have the book on us. Maybe that's the issue. Bead potion, blood, fat, acceleration powder, chaos solution. No, none of that is useful. But I will put all the blood and fat there. I am greatly confused. What did I do with the book now? That's that's my other question. Let's pop back here. And we'll find out what I did with the book as well. So there's a few things that we need to just catch up on and get a hold of and it's basically understanding how to make science points. Once we've got that we'll be able to start researching in that process but it is a little bit confusing at the start. Right that is made. We could make glass. I'm not sure if we need to at this point so I'm not gonna jump in and start making it. So I've got old books. Right. No, that, that, that shouldn't be an issue. Hmm. So maybe we need it at a desk as opposed to... So we've got the study table, the desk. Okay, so we can't do that. We really do have to just dig up someone and then mess with their their skin, I think. I think that's what we'll need to do. Okay. So we basically start getting some skin. We start turning that into paper, a uh, rudimentary paper. We then, oh boy, um, we then learn the desk and then we can make clean paper. So yeah, it is possible to make clean paper from pig skin. It's just a more, more roundabout way, but we'll sort this out first. Trade. Take all three of them. Okay, and do you have anything that I might want? Not really. No. We'll accept that offer. We do need to find... Is it the merchant who has seeds? Yeah, I think it was the merchant who had seeds. Bugger. Who are you? No one. The door is closed until I have 40 smiles with Adam. I think Adam might be the potter. Okay, what about up here? Who can we talk to about the... Uh 
what was going on with the vampire as well. That feels like something that we could look into. Oh, are we getting honey? Nice, we got some honey. So, honey is... Ooh, plus 25 crafted a beehive. Absolutely going to use that. There we go. Yeah, I don't know if the game should give you, like, style points to begin with. I think that would be a good... Good way to go about it. What do we got here? Yeah, down here looks to be the farm. Maybe we'll go around here and we'll buy some seeds. Yeah, if the game gave you, like, some study points or... Maybe just some paper or something, you know? But, hey, um... It could also simply be that I am slow at the game. Oh, can we enter? The door is closed. Okay, here's the oh, no. oh, yeah. <laughs> Whatever you're selling, I'm not buying. Even if it's drugs or magic elixirs. I'm just looking around. I don't know what's happening, but everyone is telling me I'm the graveyard keeper. Oh, yeah. Ah, then you're even worse than those shifty traveling merchants. Uh, mm. I must say, your whole profession is a fraud. I don't like you. Oh, yeah. Now that I've made my position clear, we can do a business. Trade. Okay, I would like to buy... Uh, what do we got? Wheat seed. Now, it's four per tile, so I want to get 12. And then I also want to do carrots, so let's get a 12 of those. Alright, there we go. Do we want to sell him those carrots? No. We, we basically wouldn't get our money back at that point. It's a lot of wheat. Oh. oh, my my footsteps lined up so that I'm walking in my other footsteps. You can't tell if I'm coming or going. Here we go. All right, let's make a couple of these. Oh, these ones are ready too. Yep, done. 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 Build garden bed with sticks. Uh, yep, yeah, we're going to do wheat. Nope. There we go. And what do you know? We're farmers. We're farmers again. And on that high note, and that's where we're going to end today's episode. We have explored more, identified what we need to do to the bodies in order to get the paper. We have started our farming career, and we finally have the forge free. Thank you so much for watching. If you like what you see, please do leave a like and subscribe. Everyone counts and means a lot. Thank you very much. See you next time.